Our camera's on one man. A hat-trick in his last game. Can he continue that red-hot form? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome from the English South Coast. This has always been an atmospheric venue, Fratton Park. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And all about action from League One coming right up. It's Portsmouth against Bristol Rovers. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is... Can he take the chance? Well, from that position, he really should be doing more to work the goalkeeper. Hunt. Well, credit to him for the challenge and the throw in conceded. Connolly. Finlay. And a fine tackle. Good movement. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Well, the fact of the matter is the home side lead the league in goals for the best attack in the league statistically. Well, their attacking play has been brilliant. They're always looking to pass it forward. The wide players get good crosses into the box and the forwards are taking their chances. These fans will be hoping for more of the same today. Oh, hang on, Stuart. It's a chance. A smart stop here. Who can they pick out? Appear to be in two minds. Finlay. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. But then the one that goes astray. Scott Sinclair. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Electing to cross into the centre. Well, a really good idea, but missing by a large margin. Lang deserves credit for winning the ball back. I must say, this looks promising. But really sticking to the task defensively. Shaughnessy. Ogilvy. Lane. Could be dangerous. for it and now they've been rewarded well as you can see he gave the keeper no chance there he looked so confident didn't he that's a cool finish And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Going well. Delivered into the box. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff.
delivering it behind for another corner can they cash in Well, a short corner here. Hunt. And a goal to square the game. Edge of the seat stuff. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Well, you can see his frustration. They've just lost their focus here. So the ball is rolling again at one all, And a scoring update to bring you from the Wickham Wanderers game. Alex Scott. Yeah, it's a goal for Derby County. The score's level again now at 1-1 with 41 minutes on the clock. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. And the flag has gone up offside. Lang making progress we've been waiting to find out now we know a minimum of three added minutes here Scott Sinclair and nothing comes of this attack Half time then, that's going to be all for the first half here on the south coast. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Tremendous intuition to win it back. The referee spotted the little nick on the way through, so a throw-in coming up. And Gordon now. Given him too much space. Scott Sinclair. Oh, he's given it away. And back with Gordon. Connolly. Finlay. Giovanni Brown well, just the tackle that was needed and into the last 30 minutes now and moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here could play it in in position and that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Good idea. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Well, he can't control his delight, can he? It's a wonderful moment for his team. 
So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Finlay. Connolly. Hunt. It's with Connolly. Evans. Brown. It's with Sinclair. Colby Bishop. Promising looking ball. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Hunt. Finlay. It's with Sinclair. Nice looking pass. Very effective pass. Opportunity to level it. Oh, it was there for him to get them on level terms. Well, that's a big miss. That should have been the equaliser there. Lang. A chance maybe from the wide position. Good looking move. Able to get his body in the way. Evans. Hunt. Well, it's almost over, but not quite. The fans still with a bit of nail-biting to do, Stuart. Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Pressure applied. And the referee sensibly allowing them to carry on. Advantage with them. Well, it didn't worry the keeper. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, it was close. But as we mentioned before the game, their ability to score is second to none. And even though they weren't at their very best today, they still came up with two important goals.